Tonight we're honoring co-MVPs, sisters who grew up around a hockey rink and are now skating together. WBZ's Nick Giovanni is in Andover with this week's BZ's MVP. They've been teammates ever since they were toddlers. Um, so both our, our parents played hockey, so it was from a pretty early age. Um, they would build the rink in our backyard, and we went out there when we were like two or three. For sisters Caroline and Maggie Averill, hockey is in their blood, and they've always bled red, white, and blue. Like we've also always had like USA jerseys and like would put those on in the back of yeah. the rink. From that homemade rink, the two have come up the ranks together. Caroline, now a sophomore forward at Phillips Academy in Andover. Maggie, a freshman, plays defense for Big Blue. Who's the best hockey player in the family? <laughs> Maggie, for sure. Caroline. There's not like a sibling rivalry here, then. Not <laughs> really. <laughs> Rather than a rivalry, these siblings share nothing but respect for what each brings to the ice. <laughs> um, I just feel like watching you, like your work, work ethic is like admirable and like in the gym, on the ice, just mm -hmm. everywhere. So. I feel like the same for her. It's very obvious to me that they do it because they love it. Martha Fenton's not only coached the two Averills, but their older sister Anne, who now plays for Dartmouth, and their mom Allie, who was a two-time finalist for the Patty Kazmaier Award while at Princeton. I see little pieces of her in all three of the girls. It's cool to look at her old stuff and yeah. like follow in her footsteps a bit. Well, they're not only following in their mom's footsteps to Phillips Academy, but all the way to Team USA. After going through a series of camps and tryouts starting this past spring, the Averills learned last month they both made the under-18 national team. Once you make the team, it's like, oh my gosh, can't yeah. believe I've made it this far. Yeah, for me, I feel like I was just focused on like making U18 camp first, and then all of a sudden, like the next thing and the next thing, and it just happened so fast. Yeah. At every turn, yeah. sisters didn't just have each other to lean on, but another Andover teammate joining them on the national team, Molly Boyle, who's competed in the USA camps the last three years. I think it's very comforting to know you have like two familiar faces, people you've like played with before and like on the ice just like knowing what like some of the things they'll do and like knowing like when they have the puck I can trust them. Boyle, a junior at Phillips Academy, is a three sport athlete and a captain on the prep school hockey team. She's a huge role model on the team and definitely mm -hmm. like we both look up to her and uh -huh. the way that she works and how impressive she is on the ice. Yeah. The three have built a special bond on the ice, playing to each other's strengths on the game's biggest stage. And knowing the unique opportunity they have in front of them, their goal is to bring home a gold when they head to Switzerland in January for the IIHF Under-18 Women's World Championship. It'd be really special. Like, yeah. Um, Especially it's on her birthday. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, that would be exciting. Uh -huh. <laughs> Living out their childhood hockey dreams together, only fitting, Caroline and Maggie Averill also share the title of this week's BZ's MVP. Wow. Amazing experience they'll always have. Can't imagine the competition between oh, the yeah. two either, right? <laughs> At home, playing hockey. Yeah.